Okay, welcome back everyone to another episode of the Ultimate Empire where of course we are fighting a war again another war We all do, we always have to be fighting wars uh, This one I'm not even sure what the heck they want. They want to liberate Franklin. Oh, I see they want to liberate this region right here You know what I don't have any sentiment towards that region at all. Let's see. Let's see how much is it actually producing for us? Yeah, Franklin's actually producing a good amount of things for us. Um, probably losing this would lose a lot, but I'm... Oh my goodness, they still have that alliance. Okay, so I can't do it yet. Okay. Uh, okay, but anyways, we basically have a situation where the North Germanic Federation is mobilizing against us. They're sending in all the troops to come fight me. Uh, don't really know why I haven't even tried to do stuff. They just want to go free the lands of Franklin. By the way, Austria formed again, people. Yay! Austria is back in this game. The Dutch menace. They're coming for us. Alright. And, yeah, we may have to deal with the Germanic Federation for a little bit. I think, I think what I'm going to do in this war is actually just fight them back to a, uh, you know, neutral stance. I don't really feel like I want to fight them all the way. Okay, because they're probably still too weak to fight all the way anyways, but... Yeah, I don't want to fight the Germans all the way. Okay. German tactics, very good against me. Wow, they actually are really good. But that's kind of making me sad right now. Because they were never this good when I was there. Eh, you know what? You know, prove it. You guys get it. Uh, I cannot be bothered with little tiny pieces of land. Let's see, I lose 27... If Eh, that's kind of it's it's kind of bad but I still got enough I still got enough to survive let's be real here I still got enough to survive but Germany definitely on my hit list and what I think I'm gonna use I think what I'm gonna do is probably once hopefully hopefully Sweden will be able to drop from the great power status I hope Denmark is actually rising Denmark should become a great... So Denmark should become a great power. I mean, the fact that he even conquered some land in Africa makes them deserving of a great power status. Seriously. Seriously. I mean, how often do we get to see a liberated Denmark? Alright. Apparently, that also, that kind of market fluctuation crashed my economy just a little bit. So we're going to get my economy back well again. There we go. My economy's well again. Yep, definitely well again. Haha. -ha. Alright. And Crete and Malakin can be influenced. I don't really care if either of them are, though. Uh, no, no, no. Malakin. Uh, no, Malakin. This nation right here. Okay. So, yeah. Alright. Let's see. Justification almost ready. Let's see. Will you guys form a militaristic alliance? Orm Corps provinces. Hmm. I've never heard that excuse before, but we're going to try. And if not, if they severely don't want us to, uh, if they don't let us do what we want to do, then it really doesn't matter in the end. I believe I'm going to win anyways. It's just, it'd be nice to have a new alliance with some people. Oh my goodness, France. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, if I had the militarists, if I had the diplomatic points. Okay, some kind of war just got set off. It's the... What the... Jimmy, did you just backstab your own friends? Wow. You guys are harsh truckers. Seriously. That's like, wow. Oh my goodness, wow. Wow, and they even got to the actual continent. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Wow. Just. Oh man. Wow. <gasps> I, I'm, I'm aghast, people. I'm really aghast. They just, like, once they were done with one person, they instantly moved to the next person. These guys are completely... Oh, uh, they're crazy. Not gonna deny, they're kind of crazy. Let's go get ideological thought right now, though. <laughs> oh, my goodness. They're probably not even gonna win this battle because they're not gonna have what they need. Okay, it seems like... These people want to fight me. Huh. France, you really want to fight me? Wow. Wow. Ah, you gotta be kidding me. 
I wanted to be fighting a different nation right now, but sadly they just bro drove me back into another war. <sighs> okay. Well, if we were to defend, we'd probably have to defend right there. Man. Everyone's just like declaring war. Now that I broke my alliance sphere with everyone, everyone's like, war, 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 war. Let's see, and you guys can now support like 72 troops. That's nice. Okay, you're probably going to build like two other forts right here so you guys can support even more. These guys are almost done building up their men. And let's see. Japan, you guys were almost my friends. It's a couple more days, man. A couple more days, and you guys would have been my friends. But. This is one crisis I don't believe I'm going to be able to win just because of the amount of hatred everyone has towards me. Unless by chance any of these guys want something, I believe I'm going to lose and actually have Romania form. And apparently it did not form, so I don't know what's up with that. The French technically should have won, but they just lost, so yeah, I really don't care. That was awesome. <laughs> Uh, I'm not going to count my, I'm not going to judge it, I'm just going to be like, it happened, it happened. Okay, you guys, go right here. You guys are just directly out of the actual supply limit. There we go. Okay, and let's see, how much infrastructure, holy shoot. No, we could actually build some more infrastructure off screen, I mean. In fact, let's build some infrastructure off screen. I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, we are back, and as you guys can see, we have... Done a lot of our land. I didn't quite do every part of my land because I honestly won't use most of this land over here. This is more just kind of land that's over there. So, yeah. But we have our Casas Belli against the uh, Dutch. It wears off on March 5th. So, what I'm going to do... How many men can you guys carry? Can you guys carry all you guys? Okay. What I'm going to go do is I'm going to go send these guys to the... Uh, first of all, I'm going to go send them right here to Goa. This is Goa. And what I'm going to do is from Goa, what they're going to do is they're going to go after um, the Dutch Empire. Hopefully they can make it in time before before it's time for me to declare war. Which is, again, what time? March. So March. I need to declare war in February. Okay? And until then, we're just going to kind of relax. Keep building more men. Keep every one of my capitalists happy. As a... How many capitalists do we have right now? We have 7,000 capitalists. That's a ton right there. Especially in regular Victoria 2, that's a ton. And let's see. J Britain is right now dealing with lots and lots of fighting. I'm pretty sure they're not going to be very much help right now in this in the war that's going to happen. Like, they're probably just going to fight their own. But that's fine. And let's see, now I got more troops. So let's see, Moscow has probably some... Uh, factories in it let's see no Moscow has no factories in it what would they okay that's kind of weird so they built absolutely no factories there so I guess right here in Emlia Emlia I guess Kalea wait is Kalea one of the top ones Kukits let's see oh wait let's see a lot of these C ones are really really big Okay, let's see. Let's open up this one. Let's open up that one. Let's see. Actually, who has the most craftsmen in it? Lungus. Kamiya. Okay, let's just go right there. Because Kamiya seems like it has a good enough amount of people. And will be really nice to siege back. Okay. Let's see. You guys get more militaristic tactics. Because we can. And let's see. We have to be very careful. Where is the fleet right now? Let's see. They are almost across the tip of Africa. Okay. Oof. We're probably not going to make it when I want to, but it was pretty close. Um, the war between them is going to go on for a little bit, so they're probably not going to join in. Um, but the good part is, is that Sweden's going to join in. You know what that means? We could wipe out Sweden too, so let's see. Is there anyone else I can kind of give a nudge to? To kind of get rid of. Hmm. Uh, Parma I could probably get rid of because I don't really need Parma. Yeah, I'm probably just going to decentralize all of like this region. Just like everyone's going to be decentralized. So if I declare war, I can also get those guys in on it too. Conquer them too and expand my realm a little bit bigger. I like that. I, okay. Stop it. Stop. 
stop before I forget. Now the clear war. Let's see. Britain's probably not gonna join in. Oh no, they are? Really? Huh. Didn't think they would. Alright. And let's see, we have a 21k right here. Go send them over here. We have a 72k right there. Go divide them up. Go send this army to go right over here. Let's go see. Hey, Germany, would you guys give me military access? Yes, you would, but you need to be persuaded a little bit to stop hating me so much. Yes, the British joined in, so now they have instant access over there. They're probably not liking this that they have so many wars going on, but yeah, that ends the breaks. And let's see, I'm going to go send this army to go attack over here. And you, hey, Philippines, try to do something in this war. I mean, you guys could do something. You have a navy. Go use it to go invade the Philippines. Okay, because the Philippines are going to take me a while to, like, do stuff with. Okay, and I really want them dead. And let's see. Uh, you guys go destroy these guys. And, yeah. Oh, whoops, I forgot to call you guys in. Sorry. Whoops. Yeah, Lombardia, I want you guys in. Venice, I want you guys in this war, too. And let's see, who else? Ajiristan, let's just get everyone the usuals. Let's get the usual rounds. Ajiristan, uh, Armenian, there we go. Let's see, Latvia, Latvia, you guys can come in. Let's see, how much do you guys have? Wow, you guys are actually building a good sized army. So are you, Lithuania. Lithuania, and Aristona, you guys are kind of the weakest one of the three over here. Kind of stinks, because you guys could be pretty useful. Okay, and let's see. Let's see, they have a pretty good army right over there. Let's go see if we can go squish it. Yes, let's go squish this army before they group up and become even bigger. Ooh, can we squish it? Can we squish it? It's becoming pretty even battle. Ooh, it might become an even battle right there. That means we might not win that. Uh, yeah, but we do have a lot of troops from over here coming over here to go defeat them. So we should have a very good army right over there. We also have lots of railroads being made. That's pretty awesome. Uh, you guys might be going to go and going to go send in men to go conquer some of the Philippines. That would be nice if they actually went to go battle of Bozen. Uh, isn't it a sea battle, right? No. It's probably just a land battle that I lost. You kind of expected. And the British are already starting to conquer the Netherlands mainland. That's awesome. Not even trying to do anything, but that's really awesome. Uh, just let my vassals go do the conquering for me. And why do I have to do all the individual conquests? Yes, destroy everything. Everyone, group up, become a massive collective. <laughs> okay, we also have an, my own army moving into, so it isn't just like I'm letting my vassals do all the work. Are you guys finally over here? Yes, you guys are. Okay, send from here to there. Now we're going to go conquer this little island right over here. We'll start with the main Dutch island of this, and then we'll move from there. Okay. Oh, by the way, we're going to add the war score to these people first, and then go destroy everyone else. Let's see. We're conquesting pretty fast, too. So, let's see. My men are here now. Let's see. Let's go down here. Go help these guys out. Oh, come on, 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 come on. Yes! I made it! Ha ha! Now you guys get to die. Now you guys get to die. Now you guys get to die. Ha ha. So, there we go. We defeated some more Swedish uh forces and let's see yes of course okay yes the more simulation we have the more we'll have a better life especially considering most of our population is not even accepted culture oh gosh we only have 5.1 percent that's pretty terrible right there okay and we're just gonna siege down this province right here because a lot of my troops are now just going right here let's just go right there Let's go right here. I'm just going to help everyone siege down everything. Because why not? Okay, and we have our troops right over there probably. Okay. You guys unload. Get all the troops onto the mainland. Let's just see. And there we go. Divide them up because they're already suffering nutrition. Go send half of them over there. Go send the other half over there. There we go. And there we go. That looks pretty nice right there. Okay. And then... Over here. Man, I wish some of these guys would actually declare war. I don't know why. Wait, why are you guys retreating? Okay, let's go get army statistics. 
Um, machine guns, let's get some machine guns out there. Oh, because machine guns would be pretty awesome to have. Let's be real here. Machine guns would be pretty awesome to have. Let's see if we can destroy a little bit more of the army. Let's see, where are you guys moving? Oh! Hmm. Netherlands are doing a little bit over there, while the British are completely destroying all the Netherlands' main force. I mean, wow, Netherlands, you guys got owned. Okay. Let's see, and we lost the battle over here because most likely due to the defense. That defense modifier is just killing us right now, I swear. I swear, let's see, we can also hire our education just a little bit. Increase our research speed just by a little bit more. And let's see, press through all this. Okay, and let's see. Yeah, that those guys are going to be annoying to deal with. Uh, let's see, do I have any more men? I should. Go send these two armies down over here to go destroy the, uh, to go destroy the, uh, this one force. Even though the rest of this army is pretty big, it's that one force right there that's going to be an annoying, annoying army. Ha! You see how it feels now, Sweden? Oh, and they just moved into even worse lands. Okay, you guys are conquering the top. Let's go right here, let's go right there. You guys go siege up right here. And there we go. Oh my goodness, okay, and we're dealing with a little, we're dealing with the rest of this, and we just need to defeat Sweden now. Okay, let's see, and we're probably going to have to wait till my soldiers show up here. Mm. Let's see, sweet, oh, by the way, Switzerland, Switzerland, add war goal, there we go, okay, so once you guys are all dead, we have your land. I just want to guys oh wait. Let's go deal with this first. Just so that just so that these guys could start unseaging all this land. So I already know how this is gonna work. Everyone move in. Everyone go 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 go. And boom. Yeah, let's go destroy all these guys so we make sure we kill all these guys. There we go. And now these guys can go unseage all this land. If they have any more troops, they can go unseage all that land. Okay, let's go down here. The British have basically sieged up all of this land over here, and now they're attacking, they're attacking Germany from this land, which is nice, but also kind of like annoying, because that means that they're going to be using men I don't want them to. Okay, and let's see, Sweden's also providing a very good force to counteract me. I don't like that necessarily. Let's go send these guys over here to go counteract that. Let's go see, let's go keep moving down here. Because right now, I think we have the advantage over here. I don't think they have any troops. And still, these guys of the Philippines are still not much help to my empire. They are actually stinking pretty bad. I'm not even going to deny they are stinking very bad. Local poor, let's just get the middle class mad. Get the middle class mad. Alright, get all you guys building more factories. Okay. And let's see. Let's see. All my men are moving down again. Let's see, we got more soldiers being built. Let's see, where the siege is actually. Occupation. There we go. That finished. Let's go down here. Let's see, there's only three men. Go destroy them. Go destroy these three guys. There we go. And now we can just freely attack. And I'm looking at the sieges to make sure they finish on time. And none of these guys really want the desert. Hmm. Interesting. But there is gigantic battles going on in the desert because uh, the Dutch stopped moving in for some reason. Wow. I was really rooting for you, Dutch. Like, you guys were one of the few people that actually had really good alliances. Okay. Let's see. Go help. Go help our men. Go help our friends. Go help our friends. Alright. 43 men. 43 men. Oh my goodness, we got slaughtered. That was a utterly... What do they have that's helping them so badly? Do they have gas attacks? No, it's just that we suffered so badly that they just won. But they have six men. Literally six men. Okay. Which means I'm probably going to have to, since this is so close, I'm probably going to have to build another army to see. So, I'll actually wait until the next episode because we are actually going to end today's episode. So, I want to thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.